I give thanks and glory to Almighty God for this wonderful day today. It is an auspicious and blessed occasion for family of Vidya Bhavan Higher Secondary School to share the joy and happiness to commemorate the inaugural ceremony of basketball court by our honored guest, Lieutenant General Rana Pratap Kalita. Sir, your august presence in our midst is deeply appreciated and we honored. We are honored. Once again, thank you very much, sir. We humbly express our sincere gratitude and acknowledge the good gesture of the Indian Army for gifting this basketball court to the children of this school in general and the children of this village in particular under the project Sadbhavna of Indian Army. Sir, with a humble heart, I sincerely thank you once again. I take this opportunity to show my gratitude to Lieutenant General Harjit Singh Sahi, Commander Three Corps, for his kind presence in our midst. Thank you, sir, very much. I also express my gratitude and acknowledge all the officers and jawans from Three Corps Rangapahar for their dedicated and commitment all throughout the construction of this basketball court. Words are not enough to express our gratitude for all that you have done. Thank you once again. I must mention our deep, our deep sense of gratitude to District Administration Dimapur, the Commissioner of Police for their valued support and cooperation. I also take this opportunity to thank 43 Assam Rifles for their pipe bands and support. Thank you, do keep the good work. We also want to appreciate and acknowledge the dignitaries and distinguished guests for their presence here today. Our sincere gratitude to our village council, council chairman, the chairman of the three KELS, the Kuda Youth Organization, our GBs and elders for their unflinching support. Thank you. Words are not enough to express our gratitude and thankfulness to our esteemed parents without whose support and cooperation we would have not reached this far. Our sincere gratitude also goes to our friends from print and electronic media. Thank you very much for your support. I also express my thankfulness and gratitude to the managerial board of Vidya Bhavan Higher Secondary School for their constant support and guidance. I humbly express my gratitude to my colleagues and staff for their constant support. I would just say a big thank you to you all. Once again, with honor, I thank each one of you for the unflinching support and your presence here today. Even though I'm unable to mention everybody's name yet, don't feel you are missed out. Rather, we acknowledge and appreciate your presence. Thank you all. God bless. Jai Hind. Morning to all. I extend warm welcome to our honored guest, Lieutenant General Rana Pratap Kalita, PVSM, UYSM, AVSM, SM, VSM, General Officer Commanding in Chief, Eastern Command, Commander Three Corps, Lieutenant General Harjit Singh Sahi, Officers from the Armed Forces, the Police, Government of Shields, Invitees, and all our friends from the press and media. Ladies and gentlemen, and my dear students, your august presence is deeply appreciated and we are honored to have you all in our midst as we inaugurate this much-awaited basketball constructed and gifted to the children of the school under Project Sadbhavna of Indian Army. This sports facility will add to the existing football ground, badminton, swimming pool, table tennis, billiards inside the school campus. I take this opportunity to convey our immense gratitude to the Indian Army for taking up this project Sadbhavna under the personal initiative of General Kalita. General Kalita incidentally is a schoolmate of mine from Senate School Golpara in the early 1970s. Let us all give a very big hand for General Kalita. Thank you, sir.
Thank you all. We give thanks to Almighty God for blessing us with a very pleasant weather and we commit everything to God to guide our program. Let me begin with a brief introduction about the school to you. The Vidya Bhavan School was set up as a primary school by our late father, Kri Hule Kire, in 1989 at the K Kire Colony, Kuda Village, Dimapur, to provide affordable primary education to the children of the colony and its neighborhood. The school was established with an area of 5,000 square feet with five thatch houses with toilet facilities in the old campus. The school is recognized by the Directorate of School Education, Nagaland, and is affiliated to the Nagaland Board of School Education. The first batch of high school living certificate examination was in 2007. Gradual upgradation and recognition through the years by the government of Nagaland led to the present Vidya Bhavan Higher Secondary School status in 2019. The vision and objective to provide affordable quality education, promote all-round holistic, spiritual, moral, social, cultural, physical, mental development and empower the students to become responsible and productive citizens continue to be our guiding light. The school was shifted to its present complex in 2019 on completion of the infrastructure in the new campus starting from January 2021 for class 6 to uh, 12 and on 18 April 2021 for nursing, nursery classes up to class 5. The school presently has an, an enrollment of 1,471 students. The past percentage of the school in the high school living certificate 2007 was 97% uh, and the school is maintaining its excellent result with over 95% of pass percentage with toppers in the state rank. The school was upgraded to higher secondary education uh, uh, to in the year 2019-20 with arts and commerce stream. The school is catering to holistic education with affordable tuition fee with the mission motto of education affordable to all. We have scouts and guides in the Vidya Bhavan school which was started in the year 2011. The scouts and the guide of our school has also backed the highest number of governor's medal in the state. We also have the National Cadet Corps the school has boys NCC unit uh, under 24 Nagaland one company NCC. Associated NCC officer is in charge of the unit. Cadets undergo training in the school on regular basis and training camps held annually. We also have got the Eco Club, which is also selected as one of the best uh, practicing schools in the National Green Corps program. We have a health club. The Junior Red Cross unit of the school was inaugurated in 28 February, February 2011 by our elder brother, late Zakia Kire. The then General Secretary, Indian Red Cross Society, Nagaland. Here the, teacher, uh, the children are taught to respect for the individual and to care for the well-being of fellow human without discrimination. We also have a cultural crop in the school Scholarships, awards, and concessions named after the memories of our parents are awarded to school who excel academically. These are also gifts and rewards for the staff with full concession in fees to the staff children who get this award. We have the Krihule Kire Award uh, for Academic Excellence uh, for the top uh, uh, HSLC, HSSLC top uh, 20 holders, and also uh, for those who achieve more than 60% and above in the aggregate, then we also give uh, award to the distinction holders. The Chanyo uh, Kire Scholarship for meritorious uh, students are also given to the extremely poor uh, children, 
and also another award in the name of uh, our mother is also given for outstanding service to the faculty members. These are in brief some insights into the school and its activities. On behalf of the management board, students, teachers, parents of Vidya Bhavan Higher Secondary School, I extend a very warm welcome to each and every one of you this, to this program. Thank you. Jai Hin. Nagaland TV, Sop Manulaga Awas. Watch us live on Geo TV and on your television sets as well. For Dumapu viewers, we are on channel number 994 in Global Chapter. And Kohima and Mokokchong viewers, switch to channel number 138 on Hornbill Digital. For all news and updates, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter.